Okay, we are live. Oh, praise God, praise God. One of these days where technology turns against you, praise Jesus. And that's always a great sign, you know, when you have one of these days where technology decides to fight against you, that's a sign that's going to be a good spiritual day. Often that's a spiritual warfare sign, which is so good. Praise Jesus. You know, that's one of the lessons. Like people are so afraid of spiritual warfare, um, but that's such a false perspective, right? Because um, this microphone's not on, by the way. Uh, it's such a false perspective because when spiritual warfare happens, it's a sign that you're doing something right, something useful, something that the devil's getting uncomfortable with. <laughs> If he's not attacking you, there's the microphone. If he's not attacking you, there's a problem. Okay, praise Jesus. How's everybody doing? Let's go, Kathleen. We are huddled around our lady candles, lit, waiting for you, Father. Oh, I'm so honored. I love the uh, candles. I got to get some. It's been a while since I've had some, but they provide such an atmosphere of silence, nightly contemplative time that just makes you so conducive to prayer i just saw the uh, cabrini movie went to see it today loved it you know such a such a movie that inspires resilience and fortitude the virtue of fortitude um yeah it kind of uh, inspires the uh type a within right the saint who gets so much done and perseveres and fights against so much adversity and of course um of course uh any saints uh is not just a doer but also a contemplative right every grace every source of inspiration all strength that we have comes from that life of prayer union communion with jesus uh, okay. I'm going to be preaching tomorrow at a small country parish. I'm looking forward to it. <clears throat> it's like a small country parish with 40 people on a Sunday mass. And I love it. I would, I would honestly preach to a few people if they're in the pews. Um, okay. Sorrowful mysteries. Sorrowful mysteries. Let's go. God bless everyone this way. Let's pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Eternal Father, we offer you this holy rosary in union with the passion of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. May great graces be released throughout the world because of the sacrifice. We unite our prayers to this holy sacrifice. We pray for those who are on the verge of hell. We pray for those who are far from God, those who do not know him. We pray for those who are dying and are in need of grace, healing, repentance. We pray for an outpouring of the Holy Spirit upon them. We pray for trust, for mercy, for our Lady's presence to meet them at the hour of death. We pray for the sick and the suffering. We pray for those who suffer in our families and among our loved ones, for the healing love of Jesus to raise them up, bring them consolation, consolation of suffering together, and the consolation of healing. We pray for priests, religious, cardinals, bishops, our Holy Father, for lives of holiness, purity, evangelistic zeal, deep Eucharistic and Marian love, deep love for the tradition of the church, protection for the tradition. We pray for those who are considering abortion. We pray that they may have the graces to choose life, the strength to choose life. We pray for um, those who are in dark places, we pray for those who are in the sex trafficking industry and any form of human trafficking. We pray for their freedom, their liberation, their healing. We pray 
put repentance and conversion of our perpetrators. We pray for an intention that Nancy brought to us uh, for her daughter who suffers from insomnia, depression, and spiritual attacks. We pray for healing for Nancy's daughter in Jesus' name. And trust her to the Immaculate Heart of Mary for her mother's intercession against all evil for mother's protection. We pray for family members who are struggling, family members who are far from God, family members who are struggling with depression or addiction, anxiety, loneliness. We pray for the holy souls in purgatory for their purification. Um, for those especially who have known to pray for them, we pray for deeper conversion in our lives, deeper intimacy, deeper surrender to God's sacred will in areas where he's asking us to surrender. We pray for the church. We pray for renewal, for protection, for our Holy Mother's guidance, for the Holy Spirit to purify and to renew church for any personal intentions for christian marriage and family life great intention julie for reparation to the sacred heart of jesus for reparation to the immaculate heart of mary against all blasphemies and ingratitude that they've had to endure. We pray for reparation and consolation. Pray for vocations, increase, increase in priestly vocations, religious vocations, vocations to marriage, a holy marriage as well. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. And in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence, he shall come to judge the living and the dead. And I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase of the, of the virtues of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The first mystery of sorrow, the agony in the garden, 
let us contemplate our Lord's burden, his heaviness in bearing the sins of the world, the dark night that he had to experience, to the point of sweating blood, it was so heavy. Thank you, Jesus. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The next mystery of sorrow the scourging of our Lord Jesus in the pillar. Saint Faustina's vision shows us that he was scourged, scourged because of our sins of the flesh. His flesh had to suffer for repentance for sins of the flesh. Let us offer this decade. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls into heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The next mystery of sorrow the crowning of our Lord Jesus with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. <coughs> Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The next mystery of sorrow, Jesus carries his holy cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The fifth mystery of sorrow, the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. Take a moment, dear brothers and sisters, to just imagine and contemplate his pain, his sorrow, his scarred face, his teary eyes, the blasphemies, the cruelty thrown at him. One of the mystics in her visions shows us that Jesus suffered convulsions on the cross, spasms, convulsions, as he uttered his last breath in front of his mother. There was the most horrific death. Contemplate the depths of love. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, our mourning, and our weeping in this veil of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O Clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O most holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the divine power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. For our Holy Father, Pope Francis, for his sacred intentions and for his apostolic ministry. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive all those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Saint Gemma Gilgani, pray for us. Saint Francis, Francis of Assisi, pray for us. Saint Francis Cabrini, pray for us. Saint Joan of Arc, pray for us. Saint Clair of Assisi, pray for us. Saint Benedict, pray for us. Saint Paul of the Cross, pray for us. Saint Scholastica, pray for us. Saint Maria Goretti, pray for us. Saint Bernadette, pray for us. Saint Maximilian Maria Colby, pray for us. Saint John Paul II, pray for us. Blessed Jose Papiusko, pray for us. Saint Faustina, pray for us. Blessed Chiara Luce Padano, pray for us. Saint Jose Maria Scriva, pray for us. Saint Gertrude the Great, pray for us. Saint Elizabeth of the Trinity, pray for us. Saint John of the Cross, pray for us. Saint Teresa of Avila, pray for us. Saint Thomas Aquinas, pray for us. Saint Catherine of Siena, pray for us. Saint Dominic, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, pray for us. Blessed Solanus Casey, pray for us. Saint Mary Magdalene, pray for us. Saint John the Baptist, pray for us. Saint John the Beloved, pray for us. Saint Peter, pray for us. Saint Paul, pray for us. Saint Simon Zealot, pray for us. Saint Andrew, pray for us. Saint Joseph, Terror of Demons, pray for us. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, Queen of Heaven and Earth, Queen of the Angels, Queen of the Heavenly Armies, Queen of our hearts, pray for us. All God's holy angels and saints, pray for us. Holy souls in purgatory, pray for us. And the Lord be with you. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And go in peace. Thank you, Gwen. Yeah, sharing the interview with Bishop Schneider was a great honor and privilege to be able to interview him. True Prince of the Church, true apostle, makes me think of a contemporary Athanasius, Saint Athanasius, great defender against heresies. Okay, so good. Okay, tomorrow we have our spiritual teaching, spiritual principles. Tomorrow I will be giving a live stream, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time American, um, teaching on five ways that the devil attacks, demonic attacks, spiritual warfare, and ways to battle against demonic attacks. So it's going to be both spiritual and practical, faith and reason, because the devil does attack, but it's also important to realize that not every temptation is from the devil. So we'll get into that as well. Um, okay, that's it. You know, I was thinking as we were praying that I hate those demons, Mary. Mary okay, you want to hear something crazy? I swear this is not heresy. Okay, I swear it's not heresy. My spiritual director said it to me. He's orthodox, uh, small o. Um, God loves so infinitely 
that God even loves the demons. Isn't that crazy? I mean, it's true. God's love is so powerful, sublime, and infinite that he even loves the demons. And how can that be as they are pure evil? It is because he feels pity for them. He created them, right? He created them out of love. And he feels pity also for the decision that they made, which of course led them to absolute misery and rage and betrayal. It's almost like perhaps, perhaps it's the analogy of having a child and seeing the child go astray and seeing the child choose evil. And there's something, of course, in the parent's heart that would experience immense sadness, but it doesn't mean that the parent would stop loving them. So it's profound, right? Because hate is the language of demons, right? And it's it's crazy. The demon has no love for us, right? The demon has no sympathy. The demon would backstab you, right? No sympathy whatsoever. But we are called to holy measures. And I think the only thing that we are called to hate is sin. So the fruits of the monarch temptation, sin. But other than that, we are not to hate anyone or human or angelic even the fallen angels but yeah sin is deplorable somebody was giving me some food i was visiting someone a friend and they were um treating me to something to eat and they said are you allergic to anything and i said yes i am allergic to sin but any food will be fine. <laughs> Not too picky. <laughs> oh, praise Jesus. Really? Hermitus, Shirley. Yes, really. Or I should be. You should be. You know, there's something beautiful when we are in good spiritual states, when we have a strong communion with our Lord, when we are really surrendering to his grace communing with him well, praying well, overcoming temptations, that sin becomes ugly to us. Sin becomes something that doesn't even have an appeal. You know, the temptation of sin, the grasp of sin loses its strength. So I appreciate those moments of grace and surrender. They're beautiful moments. They cause persistent illnesses. That's true, actually. You know, that's that's so interesting that uh, Kathleen, if I'm reading that correctly, if I'm reading that, um, that you're saying that sins cause persistent illnesses. There is a connection, you know, there is. Um, so I've, I've known people who've said that, um, I know one person who said that when she struggled with lust, um, that it made her physically sick, you know? Um, Jason says, I hate demons. Sorry. It's okay. I forgive you. <laughs> the demons won't forgive you. <laughs> but, you know, what do I want to say to that? Um, Compare it to something like this, okay? A politician. A politician that you may feel strong, antagonistic feelings towards because the person supports evil and they're deceptive in their language. They may support legal abortion, euthanasia, gender ideology, homosexual marriage anti-religious legislation and in the process perhaps receive the eucharist commit that blasphemy that sacrilege now the temptation would be to hate the person to hate the individual the temptation would be to get angry at the individual um and what happens in the process is actually a bit of a satanic temptation 
because Jesus, our Lord, actually has immense pity for them. He sees in them a child who has gone astray. He sees in them somebody who is influenced by the demons too much to the point of becoming a sin of a slave of sin. And and it's also something interesting, right? Because when we orient our hate towards another human being because of what they may represent, um, we forget that the true warfare is not against human flesh, but the principalities and powers of darkness, right? So that's one thing that we forget. The other thing that we forget is if you're fighting a demon, which in some ways we all are, you don't use their weapons. You use the inversion of their weapons. Demons hate. You use love, right? Demons curse. You bless. Demons abuse. It's it's interesting. It's 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 like if you ever study the, and there's a spiritual lesson here. If you ever study the angelic hierarchies, you know there's hierarchies of angels and there's hierarchies of demons. So, you know, certain angels, the seraph, are closest to gods, and then there's lower choirs of angels. When you study the hierarchies of angels and demons, you actually learn something about moral living and the kind of moral living that we're being called to, the virtuous living. So, for example, the demonic hierarchies in hell are hierarchies that operate under control and abuse so the higher demons abuse the lower demons they spiritually abuse them and there's a control mentality abusive and controlling towards the lower demons so it's a very sad hierarchy but the angelic hierarchy it's a hierarchy where the higher angels who are closer to god share the riches of that immediate communion with God with the lower angels. So instead of control and abuse, it's sharing the goodness that you receive, the grace that you receive, and loving those who are in the lower hierarchies. So we learn something from them, angels and demons, in terms of the relationships that we're being called to, how in our relationships we are not being called to being controlling of others or uh, possessive of the good things that we receive, not to share with them, but we're called to cultivate a kind of community that reflects the angels, a community that is generous, that is benevolent, that shares the divine goodness and riches that we receive from God. So you share the riches that you receive from your spiritual life. You don't become a spiritual hoarder. Um, yeah, so there's a beautiful reflection of the virtuous living that we're being called to in the with uh, through the example of the angels. And I realize that I have spontaneously, perhaps by the grace of God, turned this rosary session into a lesson on angelology. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Is this part one in tomorrow will be part two? That's right, Mary. Heck yes. That's that's what I'm talking about. Yes. Amen, Mary. That's a good perspective. And yes, Mary, you are close with your guests. Mary said, Bishop Strickland will be interviewed. I said, no. And I said, stop guessing because she was getting too close. <laughs> okay. God bless you. See you tomorrow for spiritual teaching. Know of my love and prayers and appreciation.